what's up guys in this series we're gonna learn uh, how to make web application using spring boot so but first of all what is spring boot spring boot is a tool that that's a uh, stand between the a developer and the spring framework itself so so back in the day the developer used to create if the developer wants to create a web application using spring framework he will or he or she will need to do a lot of conf configuration manual configuration from this uh, configuration there is xml file and yaml and so on so spring free spring boot came in the way to facilitate this configuration for the developer and let make the developer more productive and uh, be able to just focus on the code and the code aspects so so spring uh, boot provide uh, so many auto configuration for you and even uh, 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 even what uh, spring uh, spring boot uh, call starter those are the some uh, uh, like wizard to start a wizard to start your your uh, application so spring boot make it easy for a developer to just start a spring framework projects and work with it s without the need to do all the manual configuration and uh, and the uh, other stuff so what is spring boot let's go to the official site of spring boot so there is a overview spring boot make it easy to create standalone production grade spring based application that you can just run you mean it, it that mean you didn't have to configure your application and uh, for example install a server and deploy this and deploy the application to the server to be able to run it it has a lot of a lot of auto configuration that's you can just create the application and it's ready to run and uh, it contain and uh, you, the the application the spring boot application will uh, will contain some other feature as well from the this feature there is an embedded tomcat uh, embedded server so you don't have to uh, to install a server to be able to run your application uh, create standalone uh, spring application uh, provide optional starter dependency to simplify your build configuration so this is so important Automati automatically configure spring and third party library whenever possible uh, provide uh, produ uh, production ready features such as metrics healthy shakes and externalized configuration absolutely no code generating to the command of xml configuration so it's uh, it's awesome and uh, here this is the, the 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 official site of the spring framework so uh, you can build microservices with the spring framework it's a reactive framework spring asynchronous it's you can build even the cloud stuff web application event it's a event driven framework uh, you can do a lot of lot of stuff with the spring spring frame framework so in this series we're gonna learn a lot of uh, we're gonna learn uh, how to make web application aka SQL web application uh, using all the using uh, spring framework models like uh, spring MVC and uh, how to connect the back end with the front end, the, the, the Java file, the, 
the controllers and other stuff to to the the, the front end the HTML and how we're gonna use a template engine uh, namely to to be able to build some dyna dynamic uh, pages and other stuff so stay tuned and uh, hopefully we'll, this year will be useful for you